we do a stall speed test right outside condo land i think i am stop right over here it'll probably be someone right behind me that wants to freaking be over here it's probably the police getting their cars over here foot to the floor it stalls out right when you do the stall speed test you see that it doesn't it doesn't want to restart see you got it on video why does it do that for a torque converter why would it do that when i'm doing a stall speed test if this shit's right out why wouldn't it have to release right there it would and it doesn't so i think we're on to something here trying to figure out a truck before we put it up to her hands or the bozos which may just fix the problem immediately i'm not sure if they will or they won't um Maybe they will, maybe they won't. I cannot even make a turn out of here. There is just so many, so much traffic. But right there is a weird thing. Like, why would that stall the engine? Same like, why would you put it in reverse and drive? Why would that stall the engine as well? But when I two-foot it, it unsticks something. That was around 1700, I think, was the stall speed, so. That's not terrible. See, since we beat the shit out of it, it idles better, it idles higher. I read all about this in the manual before, how a torque converter can, can basically cause the transmission just to freaking lock up. And I think that was our test right there, because why would it just shit out like that? It's like so much better. It's like a 99% improvement. Just beat the crap out of it. So why would it um, fix itself? You know, more dents over there. There's dings all over that blue truck. Yeah, so why would it... Um... You know what I noticed too? It doesn't have a lot of crawling power either. Well, sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. Like right now, it's crawling up the driveway. Sometimes it just won't do it at the speed. And some other times it will, so I'm thinking that's also converter related. We'll try it again. The crawl. No good torque converter. It's kind of like a clutch. It's like you're letting off the gas. See, it's going nice now, right up here. Nice, fast, be powerful. Other times this has nothing. It doesn't even want to crawl. I don't know. I guess I gotta call these freaking bozos up and just trust that they're gonna do something right by me. It's gonna cost money, I know that. But we gotta fix our old truck, cause it's awesome. And the AC works, and you know, you just can't put a price on this thing. Oh, no AC doesn't work, look at that. High speed's not working. Oh, I almost forgot, I put a new EGR valve in this thing at night. I gotta go load that video. <laughs> the the cure to California is, that's a funny. Freaking comment. What are you doing? Hey, fuck off! I'm changing my alternator. <laughs> that's right. Last night I changed my EGR valve in here, so you know. Yeah. Let's see if it stalls now, will it? That's what's... Uh, not really. So the idle changes too, which is weird. I don't know, I'll probably run around it later and be messed up again. This is acting up too again. See, I got no high speed again. You bastard. Got a loose pin. I gotta get that part from the junkyard. Look at 86, man. That's how old I am. Alright, we'll fix this thing. We gotta call up these bozos. Hopefully they can uh, do something. For on the cheap, probably gonna be like freaking 600 bucks or some shit. Maybe they'll cut me a deal because they rebuilt it and I got screwed over by them and their shitty parts they chose to use. I don't know. I'm gonna have to go play dumb like that. Or maybe they'll just say, there's no problem. And then, oh man, we're we going down. There's actually a video. There's like this German girl on YouTube, uh, Dora. And there's like a transmission shop, like way, like probably like 50 miles away. They might be like German people. Who uh, operate? There's a lot of them down here, actually. They're cool people. There's a lot of German car shops. I've been to a few picking up cars. 
they get the real German accent. No, no, no. <laughs> Excellent though. They seem to be like nice work though. Um, but yeah, they had a whole video on these torque converters, Daco, and how they're pieces of crap.